We'll be presenting today's radiopedia.org case in radiology, bilateral plexiform neurofibromas of the trigeminal and facial nerves as found in neurofibromatosis type 1. Case courtesy as demonstrated here. Case link is in the description below. Presentation, we have a 20-year-old female presenting with bilateral proptosis with periorbital and facial swelling. Taking a look at the CT brain here with contrast, there's bilateral, heterogeneously enhancing, lobulated, extraconal masses extending to the cavernous sinuses through enlarged superior orbital fissures with bilateral proptosis grade 3. Taking a look at the bone window, we can appreciate bilateral pterygopalatine fossa masses which extend through enlarged foramen or rotunda in the greater sphenoid wings. The bones are dysplastic with scalloping of the bone cortex. Lastly, there's bilateral infratemporal fossa masses as well as small heterogeneously enhancing masses of both parotid glands, mainly on the right. Taking a look at the MRI, these masses demonstrate low signal on T1, high signal on T2, and intermediate signal on flare. The intraorbital extraconal masses follow the distribution of V1. The bilateral pterygopalatine fossa masses follow the distribution of V2. and the bilateral infratemporal fossa masses follow the distribution of V3. The small masses found within the parotid glands follow the distribution of the extratemporal segment of the facial nerves. Upon biopsying these masses, it was found to be plexiform neurofibromas, which are pathognomonic for neurofibromatosis type 1 and are approximately found in 30% of patients with NF1.